Okay, so God is replacing. The, I'm going to get straight through it, guys, because the introduction, blah 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 blah, that's very good. But I just want to let you guys know that um, I'm going to get straight to it. Boom. Okay. The old Confederate system is gone. So there's no need to continue to say it. But for those who are just now tuning in, yes, this is happening. It wasn't supposed to be known, but some people already knew about it, and now it's out there, and now no one is hiding anything anymore. And um, I call myself MJ's Blue Thriller because, for one, MJ was saying what was going to happen right now. He's already been saying it. And Blue, for someone who is considered righteous and always doing something divinely, is supposed to be treated with gifts and are supposed to be blessed the same way God has promised them, but they're living in a world to where things are controlled that's slowing things down and stopping them from succeeding the way that they should, even though they, they are already going to succeed regardless. Certain things are slowing people's, people's process down because of a confederate system that was in place, and that will make someone feel very blue, okay? And Thriller is definitely just Michael Jackson's thriller like no one expected this to happen but you know the gospel needs to be preached and it's too much of other things that are causing a distraction so people won't be able to get the gospel in order for them to know so this is a thriller and everyone is able to understand um, the gospel now more than ever because there aren't any distractions or there aren't any major distractions that can cause someone to not stay focused on the on the same thing that they truly need that is related to the gospel um but back to what i was saying the school systems are free you're no longer paying for college okay um taxes are going to be gone taxes are gone there are no more paying taxes just wait for it there won't be any more taxes there won't be any more um animal slaughterhouses there won't be any more of that there won't be any more of um people taking medicines for their health when they can just eat the natural foods that grow from the ground and the things that grow from the trees and and taking you know consuming the herbs for their health that's something that god has placed here for us anyway um, people will be able to take care of the animals because these animals are actually here to protect nature and to allow nature to grow properly. We wouldn't even need to go out there in the field and cut certain things down because there are certain animals that can do that. Certain animals eat poisonous plants that are poisonous to us but not poisonous to them that's a natural way of doing things other than you know getting a rake and raking things up and it, and it end up being the wrong thing that we're raking up you know things of those small things make a big difference and this is the reason why um it's thriller because god is coming back to replace everything that should have been in place from the from the start um there are forests that are disappearing that are no longer there <laughs> and we need the oxygen because trees provide oxygen and forests are where the animals live and some of the animals have no home to go to because of that certain birds are becoming extinct certain animals other animals are becoming extinct and that is because of a confederate system who believe that tearing these things down is going to cause the people to you know, be happy because of the money, but that's another thing that's happening. Bitcoins are taking over dollar bills. Anything that's money related, anything that is in paper money that has a dead president on it, that is going to be gone completely. Money is digital. People are still using paper money and money, the real money is going to be digital. No one's even going to be able to have money anymore that's in paper form with a dead president's face on it that's gone 
and a lot of money is becoming digital because that is the best way to escape from currency being flown and overflowed um, and um, reused for um, um, dirty purposes, you know. Um, people do things under the table. They don't want you to, you know, commit a crime and give them give them some money in a bank account or give them some money um, online. They want you to do a, um, a dirty crime and give them the cash in their hands. You see what I'm saying? If you take that type of cash out, then you won't have to worry about anyone doing any crooked crimes or anything like that. It's just that simple. Not saying that crimes can't be committed for exchange of cash or money online, but it's more obvious what's happening people can tell who's lying or not things aren't verbal they're digital conversations are digital now you can take have a conversation about something else completely different to uh, manipulate and make someone else seem that that's not what you were talking about but really people are very observant about the conversation that happened on the internet so they're able to see you know, if there's something off about a conversation, you know, is he really sending, did he really just write this, write him uh, a message saying that, oh, well, I'm going to give you, and this is an example. Say, for instance, someone might say, hey, did you get those, did you get, did you pay that rent that from the money that I sent you? Oh, um, not yet. I'll go back and check. Okay, yeah, I got it. But really, that was an exchange, excuse me, that was an exchange for someone to just hide but really that money that they sent them was for to come murder someone you see it could be like that but there are people who are very crafty in how they write but there are also some people who are very crafty at investigating the truth about certain things so that is the reason why um so people can't really hide as much about hiding from you know criminal activity online because everything is investigated and people can see that more and um some people you know it's easier to catch someone in the lie online sometimes than there is in person but really no people can sense someone lying in person um but just to let you all know that you know the confederate system is leaving and everything that we should have had or we were supposed to have we are getting back okay don't let anyone tell you that you don't need this and you don't need that because you know you can have everything you want and everything you need the only thing that was stopping you from getting that or getting it fast enough is the confederate system who wanted you to pay for your freedom instead of you being gifted your freedom for having the gift within you you are valuable the fact that you know the gospel and the confederate system don't is what is the difference okay they should be paying you and now people are starting to go to school now and getting paid to go to school that's all it is in the future there won't be any more going to college to go pay for none of, none of that stuff everything nobody is really even going to school anymore people are going to school online they're not going to school. All the schools are shut down and closed. No one is in that. No one is even at school. You go to your local, go to your local middle school, and and, and everything like that. You won't see anything. The buses, the school buses, are Wi-Fi providers. They just go to different neighborhoods and and, and they are a, a Wi-Fi signal for people who don't have internet access to do the schoolwork online. And then the schoolwork online is so easy, and some people not, aren't even going to school because they are <laughs> they're finding other ways to become an entrepreneur, you know. So that is no longer here. And thank you, God. So I'm just letting you guys know that um, God has found a way, and He's always found a way. But now Jesus is here, and Jesus is, has stripped out everything, and He's currently still stripping out everything. And now we're able to live have a wonderful life and enjoy what God has promised us without any distractions, without any limitations, because we deserve it. We work really, really hard.